On October 26, 2024, the Swedish Army unveiled the CV-9035 MKIIC at the P-7 South Scanian Regiment in Sweden. This event marks a significant step in Sweden's defense modernization strategy, as the country plans to acquire 50 units of this advanced armored vehicle to replace the CV-9040C models recently donated to Ukraine. Developed by BAE Systems Haglunds, the CV-9035 MKIIC belongs to the well-regarded CV-90 family and was showcased without the additional armor that will be part of its final configuration. The decision to replace the CV-9040C units aligns with Sweden's broader efforts to replenish its military capabilities after donating over 50 armored vehicles to support Ukraine. The new CV-9035 MKIIC, known internationally as the CV-9035 and designated Stridsforden 9035 in Sweden, features a robust design that combines the chassis of the CV-90 MK3 with a turret from the more advanced MK4 version. One of the most notable improvements in the CV-9035 MKIIC is its weapon system. The previous 40mm Bofors cannon has been upgraded to a 35mm Bushmaster cannon, which is expected to enhance lethality and flexibility through the use of programmable ammunition. This change is part of a larger effort to ensure that the vehicle remains effective in modern combat scenarios. Additionally, the vehicle is equipped with two RBS-58 missiles, a modified version of the Acheron MP anti-tank system, which significantly boosts its capability to engage enemy armored vehicles, including tanks. Protection remains a top priority for the CV-9035 MK IIC. Weighing approximately 35 tons, the vehicle incorporates enhanced armor designed to withstand modern threats. It is equipped with advanced sensors and countermeasures capable of detecting and responding to threats such as anti-tank missiles. A defensive projectile system is included to intercept incoming missiles, further enhancing crew safety. To improve operational effectiveness, the vehicle features a 360-degree camera system, enhancing situational awareness for the crew. The version displayed in Sweden aligns with the model being purchased by the Netherlands, though Sweden's final configuration will include additional armor. In May 2024, the Swedish Defense Material Administration, FMV, signed a contract with BAE Systems Haglunds for the acquisition of these new CV-9035 MKIC vehicles, alongside integrated logistic support. Although the exact contract value remains undisclosed, estimates suggest that around 50 units were ordered, potentially valued at up to $360 million. Deliveries are expected to take place between 2025 and 2027. The CV-9035 MKIIC is built to comply with the Netherlands' midlife upgrade program standards, which include ergonomic adjustments to the redesigned turret. This acquisition not only aims to modernize Sweden's armored vehicle fleet, but also reinforces the country's defense partnerships by ensuring the production of additional CV-90 variants to support Ukraine's defense needs. The CV-90 family has been in service since the 1990s and boasts a diverse range of variants tailored to various operational needs, including air defense, reconnaissance, and armored recovery. Over 1,700 units of these vehicles are currently serving in several countries, including Norway, Finland, Switzerland, and Slovakia, demonstrating the platform's widespread acceptance and operational versatility. As Sweden moves forward with the CV-9035 MKIC, it is expected to play a pivotal role in fulfilling the country's military requirements in the coming years. The contract with BAE Systems Haglunds was finalized by Tommy Gustafsson Rask, Managing Director of BAE Systems Haglands, and Brigadier General Jonas Lotson, Director of Land Systems at FMV. This strategic agreement underscores Sweden's commitment to maintaining the strength of its armored units while adapting to the evolving landscape of modern warfare.